Hi guys, welcome back to Griffin's Gaming Guides. Today I want to show you how to get some nice Iridium in the early game of Borderlands 3. Iridium was a key component in completing Borderlands 2 as it gives you more backpack space and allows you to carry more ammo for your desired weapons. In this one, it's more for getting your customizable items like buying new heads, buying new skins, buying new emotes, as well as a series of fairly powerful gear. I don't want to put any spoilers in this video as it is an early game farming slot i'm going to show you this time however you'll know when you get to the point that you can use your iridium when you get to the drought there's an area over to your left it's as far left as you can go from your starting hub the area itself is called varkid valley when you're down there make your way all the way to the end and you'll come up against a legendary hunt for hammerlock this involves you taking down a series of ever more powerful varkids it's these particular Varkids that you'll fight in the Legendary Hunt that give you your Iridium. You should be looking at getting roughly 10 Iridium per run, but considering it's so early on in the game, that's not too shabby. They do have a chance of dropping a very nice Legendary Shield as well. If you do find any other Legendary items from these guys, please let me know in the comment section. You'll get some nice XP from boosting these guys as well. Now bear in mind, the fights themselves are level 8, so you want to be at least that level before you go down there and have similar leveled guns and gear. As these guys deal a fair bit of damage this early on in the game. The adult Varkids and the larval Varkids don't seem to drop anything of use. However, they are pretty good if you're farming them for the XP up until you hit their level. Obviously, with the Borderlands rules on XP, once you're five levels above the enemy, you'll only receive one XP per kill. So kill them, run past them, whatever it is you choose to do. I'm going to put a lot more information about Iridium and farming it and the usage of it and all this and any other in a video that we're currently putting together for late game Iridium farming where you can get a hell of a lot more than what you get in here. But obviously this is to set you up for what you're going to need for the upcoming game. So guys, I'd just like to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please leave a like, comment and consider subscribing. If you do subscribe, please hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future content. I hope to see you in the next one. Take care.